here welcome back to my channel I'm coming on to share with you all another DIY you know I like to share my DIYs with you <laughs> so that's what I'm going to do today and first of all I'd like to share with you guys a new bling wrap that I got from Totally Dazzled yeah I went on the site looking at the stuff and I saw that she has a black bling wrap uh-huh so you know I had to get it I said OMG I have to try that yes <laughs> so uh, this is it here and it's not as blingy as the silver and our rose gold but it's just as nice and as you can see it has a nice effect I think it does so I'm gonna come on and share with you guys some decor ideas that you can incorporate with this black bling wrap yeah and I'm gonna start off first with a wedding series because you know February is almost finished it just started and now it's practically done yeah we're going into March what comes with March spring and the nicer weather starts to roll in <laughs> so everybody's gonna be thinking about weddings and other occasions to do within the spring and summer season yeah so I'm gonna share with you got some ideas that you can use with this black bling wrap uh-huh. All right, everyone. <laughs> Let's get into the first decor that I have to share with you guys with the black bling wrap. <laughs> All right, everyone. Here are the items that we'll be using for today's DIY. And as usual, they will be listed down below in the description box to tell you what I used and where I got them from. All right, everyone, let's get started. All right, everyone, we have this bowl from the Dollar Tree and I cut our bling wraps into strips and we're just gonna glue them going right around our bowl. One black, one silver. And you know, you guys, you can use any kind of adhesive that you would like to use to glue down these bling wraps. I'm using the hot glue. You can use tacky glue. You can use E6000. I forgot what the glue from the Dollar Tree is called. You could use that glue also. Any one of them will be fine to glue down our strips. Okay, now our bowl is all done. We're gonna use this bling wrap and place along the bottom just to make it look more neat. And now we're also gonna place a strip going along the top to cover up our imperfections. Okay, now we have our vase from the Dollar Tree and we are going to use our black and our silver bling wrap in a pattern going all the way up. And we're just gonna glue down one strip of black and then one strip of silver all the way up. Alright everyone, now our vase is all done. We're going to use our gem from Totally Dazzled. You know, I love these gems. They make whatever you put them on stand out even more. So we're just going to use the hot glue and glue it down. And now we're going to take our two pieces and glue them together with some hot glue. 
you can use something stronger but for this purpose I'll be using just the hot glue and glue our two containers together and now we're going to be doing our candle holders which I'll be using the black bling wrap along with the silver bling wrap going right around our vase And I will be doing our two candle holders with this pattern. This one is a smaller candle holder and the other one is a little taller vase. And I'll be doing the same pattern on that one also. Time for my favorite part of the DIYs. And I'm just showing you how easy it is to take the back the tabs off the back of my favorite gems. Yes, we're just gonna add them to our candle holders. Yep. <laughs> And now for the base of our candle holders, we're using a round mirror and these little candle holders and I put some bling around the top part of them and I'm just going to use some hot glue. Like I said, you could use any ad adhesive that you'd like to use. I'm just using hot glue. And then we're just going to add the candle holders to the base of our candle holder, just like this. And here's our finished look. I love how the black bling wrap looks. It looks very nice. And tied in with the silver, it just gives it a pop. <laughs> I think it looks really nice. I'm glad that she got this black bling wrap. It gives you a nice, a different option to decor with, which is very nice. And I love how these candle holders turned out with the bottom and the mirror on the bottom. I think it looks super cute. And of course our gems, our lovely gems from Totally Dazzled. Like I said, you add them to anything and it just makes it stand out, look more nice and elegant. And here's our centerpiece with some flowers and with some lights. I use the, um, the LED lights that you can get from the Dollar Tree and just place them within our candle holders and within our centerpiece with the flowers and you know you can use any kind of flowers that you like I think it looks very nice all lit up with the lights and if you choose to you can just have it without flowers it still makes a nice statement piece for your table or with the flowers, both looks are very nice. I think it looks very nice with the lights inside. And I'm going to leave a link below to Totally Dazzled so you guys can go over there and check out their new black bling wrap that they have. And you know, there's lots of other things on the site and the nice gems, OMG. And here's how it looks with the room dimmed with the lights. Doesn't that look really nice? <laughs> I love how it looks. It would make a nice centerpiece on your wedding table, bridal table, any kind of occasion that you're going to have. It makes a lovely piece. All right, everyone, tell me what you think of this lovely DIY using the black bling wrap. Isn't it neat? And give me a thumbs up. Press that like button. And you know, if you're not subscribed, go ahead and press that subscribe button so you can come back and see more of the DIYs that I love to share with you all. And remember... As always, stay blessed from Petal is Blessed. Bye-bye, everyone.